Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can find your missing or lost iPhone. Now, in order for this uh, to uh, work and uh, to easily find your missing iPhone, you need to uh, uh, set up uh, Find My iPhone uh, on your device. So here you can see that um, if you go into settings, by default, when you um, sign to your iPhone, uh, Find My iPhone is already turned on by default, but I just wanted to show you where it is. So in the iCloud, if you go to Find My, you can see by default Find My iPhone should be already turned on. Uh, you should have Share My Location switch on. If you tap on that, you can see here Find My iPhone is switch on. Enable Offline Finding should be also switch on. This will allow you to find the device even when it has no uh, internet connections. So even when the mobile data is turned off and when it is no longer connected to a Wi-Fi, your device still can be located using a Bluetooth beacon. So how this works is that every single um, iPhone with an updated iOS 13, so this needs to be uh, running on iOS 13, and whenever your iPhone is being moved around from location to locations, it is passing out a signal via Bluetooth, and say I'm using another iPhone over here, this iPhone will be able to pick up the signal that is sent from the missing iPhone and because this iPhone is connected to the internet it will basically allow me to track the location of this phone so while um, your personal information is not disclosed however the specific ID of the mobile phone uh, will be uh, sent to the Apple server and from there they can track whereabout of the iPhone even when it is not connected to Wi-Fi or mobile data. So that's how uh, they can find your lost uh, iPhone when uh, it is offline. So make sure that enable offline finding is turned on. If you don't turn it on, then uh, you will have a difficult time of locating or tracking the missing device. So make sure this all this is turned on and by default it is turned on by default when you are signed to your iCloud. So um, I think it's already turned on. So you shouldn't need to worry about it. The next thing that you need to do if this is uh, already gone missing, so I'm going to turn off Wi-Fi now and uh, I'll turn off mobile data as well. So it's all off, okay. So still that data is off, Wi-Fi is off, I'm just going to switch it off. So what you need to do is um, go to your friend's mobile phone or iPad and make sure that the iOS is running on the latest. Um, iOS 13 or 13.1.2 so make sure that they have the latest iOS that will improve your chance of finding the missing device and on here you can see there is a um, find my app so you can also do it on iPad as well so if you go on iPad you can go into an iPad and tap on find my now once the app has launched at down here under the devices section what you want to do is tap on devices right here. Now you can see when I tap on the devices tab at the bottom, um, several devices connected to the same account will appear in here and it will uh, be uh, blinking. Now you can see that if the device is offline, it will show in black as my device has been offline. You can see it is in black right there. If the device is active and online, it will be having a color background like this one here. Now let's uh, take a look here. You can see when I uh, turn this device back online, I'm going to turn on Wi-Fi now. And shortly after, you should see this device will uh, go back online with a color. So take notice of that. So that's when you know whether it's, it's online or offline. Now on your device, you can tap on the icon of the device that is missing and more information will appear. Now when that list appears, you can tap on play sound you can tap on notifications or mark as lost tap on the activate button will allow you to mark the device as lost so that is what um, you can do to be able to find the, the mobile de device you can also tap on the directions and with the directions it will allow you to track where the device is and then you can try to follow the directions to find your missing uh, device now as I mentioned earlier, make sure that you are logging into a device with a software version, uh, iOS 13 or later. 
And if you are going to your computer, make sure that you go into a MacBook with the iOS or with the, an operating system, uh, the latest one, uh, such as uh, Catalina, so that you have uh, a more chance of finding your phone even when it's offline. Now, when you are borrowing your friend's mobile device, you don't need to sign them out of their account. What you can do is open up Find My App, and in here, tap on the Me tab at the bottom here, and then tap on Help a Friend. So when you tap on Help a Friend, it will open up iCloud, and that will allow you to sign in with your own um, Apple ID. And uh, from there, you can uh, uh, sign in with your account and then try to use your account to find your mobile device. And that way you don't need uh, to uh, sign out of your friend's account. So, so it's, much, it's a much easier way to uh, locating your device without disturbing your friend's account. And that's it. I hope that we will be able to help you uh, locate your missing device even when it's um, offline. Uh, because when it's offline, it still can use Bluetooth to send a signal to other device. And that Tauce device can uh, send out your locations or the phone's location. It can send the current phone's location to the Apple server. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.